Hello and welcome to Digit. In this video, we are going to show you how you can mount the A320 Antec A320 CPU cooler onto an AMD AM4 socket. To begin with, you should always read the user manual to understand exactly how to mount it. And remember, all the steps need to be followed properly for a secure and proper mount. Uh, we've already installed the processor in the motherboard or rather on the motherboord. And you can see it over here. It's the AMD Ryzen 5 5600X. And you get a bit of thermal paste in the packaging. So you need to apply the thermal paste onto uh, the processor. Once you've applied the thermal paste at the center, all you need is a pea-sized drop. You can take the CPU cooler and prepare it for mounting. Step one would be to ensure that this little plastic film is removed so that the base plate can make contact with your processor's surface. Next, align the CPU cooler. In our case, the air is being sucked in from the right and will be vented from the left. And this little clip will hook onto this bottom mounting clip and the top clip will mount onto this particular plastic clip. Next, we need to align the cooler and place it right on top of the processor and slowly lower it. Once you do have it lowered onto the processor, proceed by clipping the bottom clip first. Once that's properly engaged, use your thumb to push down on the top clip and ensure that is also engaged. And that's it. Ensure that obviously you're always on a stable and flat surface. This will help prevent any flexing of the motherboard. Now, once we lift the board, you can see how the mounting has been done. So the top clip has latched onto the plastic mounting clip. As you can see, it's properly secured. And the same thing can be said about the bottom clip, which is this one that has been mounted properly onto the bottom plastic tab. Once the two of those are in place, you can view it from the side and see how the processor is being covered by the CPU heatsink properly. Maybe this angle might suffice. So you can see the CPU cooler's base plate sitting flush with the processor IHS or the integrated heatsink. Once that part is over, you need to connect the cooling fan of your CPU cooler onto the motherboard. So look for a four pin header or a three pin fan header that states CPU fan. So uh, this is the MSI MPG B550i Gaming Edge Wi-Fi motherboard. And this little four pin header that you see over here is the CPU fan header. And right next to it is the water pump header in case you're connecting an AIO to the motherboard. So the fan header comes with, or other, the fan connector has two plastic tabs on back, which help you align the connector with the fan header on the motherboard. In this case, it's the bottom three pins that will be connected. Once they're aligned, push down, and you successfully connected the fan. That's how you mount the Antec A30 CPU cooler onto an AMD motherboard. Thank you for watching.